logically, you'll need something to shuo or to say or to speak. To shuo, S-H-U-O in the first tone. So what are you going to speak? Well, you are going to speak Chinese and you're going to speak it good. So how do you say the word? So how do you say the word Chinese or Chinese language? Well, that would be Zhongwen, Z-H-O-N-G in the first tone and Wen, W-E-N in the second tone. Zhongwen. Now, there's many different ways to say the Chinese language many. in Chinese. Other than Zhongwen, what else do we have, Chris? Uh, let me think. We have Guoyu. Right. Zhongguohua. Uh, mm-hmm. Han Yu. Yep. What else we got? We've got Pu Tong Hua. Pu Tong Hua, very Which good. you'll hear in mainland China. But for now, let's practice Zhong Wen. Let's practice saying the word Zhong Wen two times together. Zhong Wen. Zhong Wen. Do you remember what Zhong Wen means? It means the Chinese language. Repeat that after us. Zhong Wen. Zhong Wen. So how do you say the Chinese language in Chinese? Zhong Wen. How would you say you know how to speak Chinese. Ni hui shuo zhong wen. Ni hui shuo zhong wen. Let's practice this using gradual sentence construction. Ni. Ni hui. Ni hui shuo. Ni hui shuo zhong wen. Ni hui shuo zhong wen. The next word we're looking at is ma, that's M A in the neutral tone. Okay, that's the neutral tone. Remember, that's just kind of a middle tone. Um, it's not a first tone, it's not a second, third, or fourth, it's neutral. Ma. So ma is a question particle that we use with yes or no questions. So if you take it and you put it at the end of a sentence, it turns it into a yes or no question. So for example, can you speak Chinese ma? Or do you like to eat steamed chicken feet ma? Now in English it sounds weird. It sounds like you're asking your mother, Hey ma, you want some chicken feet? Or hey ma, can you speak Chinese? What do you think ma? What do you think about that ma? But not in Chinese. It's just a question particle. Put it at the end of a statement or a sentence to make it a yes or no question. Very good. Let's practice saying the word ma two times together. Ma. Ma. Do you remember what ma means? It's a yes or no question particle. Repeat that after us. Ma. Ma. So what is the particle at the end of a yes or no question in Chinese? Ma. How would you say, can you speak Chinese? Or, do you know how to speak Chinese? Ni hui shuo zhong wen ma? Ni hui shuo zhong wen ma? Let's practice using gradual sentence construction. Ni Ni hui Ni hui shuo Ni hui shuo zhong wen Ni hui shuo zhong wen ma? 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 Ni hao, ting wen, ni hui shuo zhong wen ma? Wo hui shuo yi dian. <音楽> 